going to do the long form, the Wu-Dang long form. Okay, the first bit's like the short form on the other video. We're going to start with that and it changes. So we'll come back to get your legs in. So again, starts the same. Tai Chi rest, Tai Chi ready. She's in posture, coming up. Again, this is Tai Chi beginning. Someone's going to grab the neck, the throat, and we're pushing the palms out of the way. We're smashing them down in a sort of yang form of this. But again, it's never exactly like the move. It either symbolizes it, which is an overemphasization of it. And it's all Tai Chi beginning still. We, we take the left foot forward, left palm faces me, and the right palm faces that palm. Then we come back here, we partially empty the left foot. So the toes come towards the knee, we turn on that heel, come to the right foot, and again we here, into seven stars right there. Again, left fingertips near right elbow, on guard position again. Grasp the bird's tail, it's like an overemphasized block. Coming up, tail sound nearly there. And then we're coming up to this single whip, it's like an iron palm there. Coming across the eye line, with the hands, like Keiko position, it's like a bird, okay, bird position, Keiko. And then with the hands, a single whip, two swinging gates. Again, some forms believe that's like a peck to the eyes or whatever. Um, again, this form is symbolising the grab and the palm. Okay, it doesn't really matter, it's just movement okay, at the end of the day. Okay, so from there, this is where it changes. The long form, I come this way so you can see me. It goes to, unlike the short form, it goes to high fly and oblique. Right hand comes forward. Okay, sort of nearly Ichimonji starts there. Okay, and then it's step up, raise hands, or double seizing legs. You step up here. I'm in small there. Again, white crane flaps its wings. So again, from here, the right hand's gonna come up and we're gonna circle around with the body. And again, two hands come into play here. So brush knee twist there. We're blocking a low kick and a palm towards the chest. Seven stars. And then brush knee twist them again. Seven stars. Here it comes like the short form again. We step forward to stroke the loop. That's signifying a karate chop type move. I come back a little bit there, and then we're going to step forward to parry and punch. Parry right, parry left, and parry low in a sort of gain cell type block. Lining up for the punch as if shutting the door. Someone's grabbed both your wrists, you cross the hands, and you come back to great back grip. Embracing tiger return the mountain. It's like a WWF move nearly. To cross the hands. Lovely. That's the first section of the Wu Dang Long Form.